ਅਸਲਾਮ ਅਲੈਕਮ ਨਮਸਤੇ ਸਸਿਆਕਾਰ ਐਂਡ ਹੈਲੋ ਐਵਰੀਵਨ bringing you one of the easiest simple yet full of flavor pasta recipes it's called fajita pasta very easy to make all you need is one pan and a bunch of different ingredients and that's it the ingredients for fajita pasta are three capsicums i've picked up different colors you can pick up you know whatever you like you can use all green uh, because these are really expensive 500 grams of sliced chicken breast i've sliced them in half and i'll slice them again later 1 tablespoon of red chili powder 1 teaspoon of black pepper 1 tablespoon of garlic powder 1 tablespoon of salt 1 tablespoon of cumin powder 1 cup of shredded cheese we'll take one penne pasta around 1 pound we're going to take 5 cups of milk Yes, I'm going to use milk to boil the pasta. I know it sounds kind of weird, but trust me, you are going to love this later on. I almost forgot the one chopped onion. We're going to start by adding 3 tablespoons of oil. Let's start by putting the chicken. So all the cooking will be done in one pan. I'm going to add all the spices right now. So it's salt, cumin powder, garlic powder, red chili, black pepper. With our chicken, we are also going to add the vegetables. As soon as the chicken and the vegetables are cooked, We are going to take everything out of the pan and start boiling our pasta. So our chicken and vegetables are quite a bit cooked. I'm going to remove them on a plate, leave all the juices they left inside the pan and start with our pasta. It's time to add 5 cups of milk in the pan and then we're going to add our pasta. We're going to mix the pasta well in the milk. We're going to let this cook for around 8 to 10 minutes. As you can see the pasta is almost done so we'll add the chicken in it also going to add all the veggies going to mix everything so the pasta is cooked the last thing that we are going to do is add cheese in it I have some more cheese in the fridge so why not So the pasta is ready I'm about to plate it and let's go towards the presentation. If you like this recipe, don't forget to press like. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell button for constant recipe notifications and don't forget to share it with your friends and families. I'll see you with another recipe pretty soon. Until then, it's goodbye.